and welcome back to another kit viewing. It's not an unboxing because it's already unboxed. Okay, so this is the fifth um, installment that I've done for today, so I'm getting a little bit parched. So if you, if you hear me drinking, I apologize, but my mouth is starting to get a bit dry and I'm starting to get a little bit hoarse. <laughs> um, and so I'm just... Uh, kind of trying to get as many as of these as I can get done before my husband gets home. Um, I think I should be able to get another five done, um, which will crack into my uh, princess um, series that I have um, from Mandy Manzano and Diamond Art Club. And then I'll only have, I think, about 12 or so left in my uh, Diamond Art Club collection where I'll be able to start doing my ever moments because I'm a little bit excited to get into those. Um, and then finally onto my customs, I'm super excited to get into those. So you guys can see the magnificence of the, <laughs> these customs. They're freaking cool. Mm. Okay. Without further ado, hey, let's go into this kit, which was probably one of the more popular ones everyone's minds exploded when this was released because it was a square with a b's and it's mum and nose so this was released around the um final season of um game of thrones and so there were a whole bunch of people that, including myself i'm not gonna lie they were like oh my god this is just a fan the best timing uh you can work it up whilst watching uh game of thrones it would be so apt um yeah mine's still not worked up <laughs> um i i can't remember what i was doing when game of thrones was released i think i only just got back from overseas so um, I was just in relaxation mode. Um, but it's Mama Knows, also known as the Mother of Dragons. Um, it's square with ABs and it's 47 by 84 centimeters. So it's actually the same, um, same stats as, uh, not bad, just drawn that way. So within the kit, you'll receive a DIY diamond painting toolkit. It's square has a magic applicator, comfort grip, two wax pads, craft tray, multi-placer, which is the three-placer, and some robust metal tweezers. Also comes with Ziploc bags, but they don't mention it in here. Comes in a really cool vinyl uh, plastic bag, which is really, it's like just got a great feel. It feels like quality. Um, you can see there the tweezers. They used to not offer the tweezers. They just used to have a tool kit, um, but... Now they add the tweezers in, which is a fantastic touch. Okay, so I left this plastic cover on here so you can actually see how the canvas comes packaged. Um, you can see it's still sealed. I don't even think I've unsealed this yet. I just put in my stash. Um, so, see, Diamond Art Club, Do What Makes You Sparkle. Um, so they package it like this inside the box and then that generally comes to me in Australia packaged within a, a huge box with paper inside it and it's just a really um, secure way of being able to transport the, um, the kit and then there's like no risk or sorry very little risk of it being damaged and having to be replaced by Diamond Art Club, so really they're just looking after their investment when they package it so well. Um, and everyone that I've come across that has a Diamond Art Club, they really do appreciate the extra effort. Um, so um, you'll get a kit um, containing your canvas, beautiful tarp hole and self-flattening canvas, and also a pack of drills and your uh, toolkit. So what I'll do is I'll just quickly unroll this canvas and in previous installments I've said that um, you can afford to roll this back in on itself because it is um, a self-flattening canvas which um, Diamond Art Club have patented. I wouldn't do this with a double-sided tape canvas at all. In fact, I treat my uh, double-sided tape canvases with the utmost care because I know that what happens is that if 
the bubbles are created by the sticky side that's closest to the canvas releasing from the canvas and unsticking. And it's often um, troublesome because you need to um, cut the river or the bubble and then you have to scrape it back down and make sure it sticks. Sometimes that doesn't actually work. Um, so it, the self-flattening canvas that Diamond Art Club use, um, it has like a glue. And because that glue adheres to the canvas, it, there's very, very, very little risk of, I've never seen a gl poured glue canvas with bubbles ever. If you see marks on the canvas, it's because the plastic, so this plastic here, it's because that is not laying flat and it does nothing to, um, it does nothing to uh, change the adherence of the glue. It will still be super sticky. It won't change the depth of the glue. It's just a mark where there's been some trapped air within the, um, sorry, my parents, my parents have a family <laughs> Facebook page, messenger page, and they're just popping up with all these messages at the moment. And I'm trying not to read them and trying to do this and I'm getting off track and, and like diamond art addiction, Oh, squirrel. Um, except we don't have squirrels here. So, uh, possum, I don't know. Um, something equivalent to a squirrel that's small and fluffy. <laughs> um, anyway, <laughs> here's what the canvas looks like. Oh, my word. I um, also found something as well um, rolled up within the canvas. So uh, usually I grab these out, but I didn't because I didn't unpackage it. Um, so you'll have a schematic sometimes. Uh, Mama Knows Best, 47 by 84. And that's what she looks like. You can see there, there's one AB, one, two, nine. And we go through and it's got 36 colors. So this strip I'll put through my Zyron sticker maker and I'll use it to kit up and it'll make kitting up so much more easier. Um, I've explained it in previous um, installments. So anyway, I'll put that aside as well. Okay, so this is the beautiful um, Mama Knows Best. Uh, I think on the website it's got Mama Knows. Um, everyone knows her as the Mother of Dragons. Um, so I believe the ABs, so it's one. So it'll be in her face. Oh my goodness. So I have to admit I have World of Warcraft in the background. I've got my character dancing while I do this. <laughs> the cues are crazy. Um, and if you hear that bell, that's from... <laughs> that's from World of Warcraft, I'm sorry. Um, so anyway, uh, so it's, you know, hair. Uh, where else is it? Uh, up here in the dragon. So as you can see, and you can see in the camera, it's a little bit easier. If you look down on the kit, you can't... It just looks like a whole bunch of symbols, but you can see... There's a dragon here, and then there's another dragon over here, and then I think that there's like a, th there's the third dragon on her arm. Beautiful flower and her dress. Okay, so let's have a look at these symbols. Oh, goodness gracious. Let's have a look at her face and that mug. Okay, so as you can see... She's got some ABs on her lip, it looks like. All in here, on her eye, above her eyebrow. Let's have a look at this dragon. He's such a cutie. So, symbols are quite clear. Gorgeous blues. Look at that. Stunning reds. I like the rendering from the red to the blue as well. That's one thing I really liked with this picture was the transition from red to blue in her dress. Um, it just looks really good. And there we go.
Okay, so we'll have a look at these drills. Okay, so we have So 415, 318, 350, 740, 741, 519, 739, oh, 129. So that's the AB that will be on her face. Oh, her hair, some of the dragon, just accenting, accenting some of um, the features. Three eight five five. So that looks yellow in my camera, but it's actually more of an orangey color. Uh, five nine seven. Nine four seven. Seven three eight. 3770 with some trash hiding behind there. 782. Oh, yep, poo brown. 783. Oh no, that's I rescind that comment. This is Pooh Brown. Let's let's compare. No, they they're pretty pooey. Yeah. And Mrs. Coffee's favorite color, the hijacker. Look at them. Okay. And then. this one four three five nine three eight four zero zero four four five that's actually super bright that's a really pretty color three three seven one three three seven one again four nine eight Looks like a, you can see it better there. 498 again. 321 lift off. Another one. 3760. 3826. Oh, 814, my favorite. I love that color. Yes. I get two bags of it. <laughs> and eight, two, three. And then finally, chunky strip is three, one, two, three, zero, seven, eight, zero, three. And then I'm just going to count them one, two, three, four, five, six, seven packs of three, ten. So, oh, my bad. Six packs of 310 and one pack of 939. So, so there's a lot of 310 in this. It's deceptive. It's 310 up the edges, down along the bottom, and then the stained glass design is all 310. So, yeah, I'm just going to quickly pack up those these drills, and then we'll finish.
Mama Knows Best or Mother of Dragons. Um, so this kit is a 47 by 84 centimeters. It is a square with one AB and it's just beautiful. Okay, so this is the end of this um, kit viewing. If you have any comments, likes, dislikes, um, feedback, um, funny jokes, dad jokes, leave them in the comments below. Um, and if you want me to show you any particular kit, if I've got it in my stash, I will go ahead and do a viewing for it. Um, if I don't have it in my stash, then I apologize. I don't own Diamond Art Club's entire stock. <laughs> um, I'm just trying to think if I've got any anything other than Mandy Manzano left. I might have. I think I have one. I think I have one. Maybe. Don't hold me to it. I could be completely wrong. But what, like I said, I'm trying to get through uh, five more um, kit viewings today. And then I'll have probably about 12 or 13 um, Diamond Art Clubs left. And then I'll be able to crack into my other moments and my customs. So thank you for staying with me for this long. Um, and what I'll do is um, I'll try and get through the Diamond Art Clubs as quickly as possible. And then we'll be able to have a look at some different content or some similar content but with different stores. Thanks and bye.